Hello, thanks for tuning in again. Here are the five talking points about this weekend's Bundesliga fixtures. Let's start now. First stop, Dortmund. Well, they travelled to Anderlecht with a bit of a crisis, only 12th in the league, but a 3-0 win have put them right back on track. Jurgen Klopp, though, has warned that Hamburg are not to be underestimated. They might be 18th and not very good at scoring, but they're still a formidable size. The team especially going forward and Dortmund have to be careful to defend a lot better. Should be a real cracker in the Signale Duna Park on Saturday. While well, staying at the wrong end of the table, there's a classic six-pointer encounter between Werder Bremen and SC Freiburg. They're both only separated by a single point, had a really, really bad start to the season, and serious questions beginning to be asked about the reign of Robin Dodd at Werder Bremen. He's very much under pressure, needs to get a result. Christian Streich, the idiosyncratic Freiburg manager with a bit more safety, uh, it doesn't have quite the same expectations, but Dutt, I think, after what has been a very disappointing first season in charge, is living on borrowed time. Questions were beginning to be asked of Roger Schmidt's high-energy, high-intensity pressing game. It left Leverkusen very, very vulnerable at the back, and they went five games in all competitions without a win. Well, things look a lot better now that they've beaten Benfica 3-1 in the Champions League on Wednesday, and they can continue their good run, or they should continue their good run, against Paderborn on Saturday. Well, Bayern won in Moscow, Dortmund won in Anderlecht, Leverkusen beat Benfica. That only leaves Schalke as the odd one out. Schalke being Schalke couldn't quite beat NK Maribor on Tuesday night. Well, they've got Hoffenheim to contend with on Saturday, and it's a sort of game that Jens Keller has struggled with in recent times. He's always managed to win the big ones, the crucial ones, the crunch games, but hasn't quite picked up enough steady points to see a better position than 10th in the league at the moment. And this is the sort of game that people will look out for as far as a bad performance is concerned. So real pressure on them. On Sunday, the team of the moment, Borussia Mönchengladbach, host Mainz. People looking for the full sustained contention with Bayern as a surprise team at the moment. Second, Lucien Favre's team are taking on a Mainz side who might not have Shinji Okazaki, their leading goal scorer with five goals available. The Japanese striker is still nursing a bit of a muscle injury. It's the sort of game that will give us a real indication whether Gladbach's surprising title chances are actually real or just a result of bigger sides struggling. In the meantime, you can check out the Serie A blog by James Orncastle, the La Liga blog by Andy Bratel, or of course, Ligue 1 with Julien Laurence. I'll see you soon. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.